Warning, this game may not be appropriate for all ages or appropriate for viewing at work. It includes frequent violence or gore and general mature content. Oh boy. You slowly regain consciousness. Feel that your entire head is covered with bandage. Bandage is blocking your eyes. Feeling around with your hands, you realize you're lying in a bed somewhere. Hearing the constant beeping sound is getting very annoying. What? What happened? Where am I? You feel around and notice there's something stuck in your arm. Feels like an IV line. No, don't rip out the line. Maybe I'll just lie here for a second. <laughs> Never rip out the IV, guys. Never. How did I get here? I remember leaving work, going to my car, and nothing. What happened? Maybe I should just rip out the line after all. No. Oh, gosh. You rip out whatever is stuck in your arm. It's stung, but it doesn't take long for you to feel <laughs> much better. You start to unravel the bandages over your head. Your eyes take a moment to adjust to the bright lights. I should... I should get up. You black out for a moment as you fall down from the bed. The floor feels very cold and you stumble back on your feet. You notice something on your finger. It's attached to the monitor nearby. What the hell is, th is this? Some kind of clothespin? Well, I mean, if he's determined to <laughs> get out of here, then yeah. Take the object off and soon as it was measuring your heart rate. How wonderful. Now that sound got even more annoying. I need to find a way to shut that thing down. Um, oh, thank God it stopped any more of that sound and I would have gone crazy. Am I in a hospital? How did I get here? I need to get home. Where's all my stuff? I need my clothes, my keys, and my phone before I go anywhere. That locker looks like the place to store clothes. I should check there. Okay. Better put my clothes on. Yes. Alright. So let's look in the trash. Why is my phone in the trash bin? Who put it there? It's still out of battery. I don't have a charger here, so no calling with this one. Let's look in here. My keys. Okay. Oh. Jesus, Mike. There you are. I've been looking everywhere for you. Okay. Is he a hallucination? Chris, what? What are you doing here? What am I doing here? The real question, question is why you're still here and not in the party. It's mandatory to participate, you know? Come on, Mike. We're in a hurry. What party? You're seriously going to wear that? No, you're not going to wear that. Wear what, Chris? What the hell are you talking about? That outfit. We're late, and you're looking like something that crawled out of a trash can. Okay, here's what we do. You go get that tuxedo from the dresser, slip into that, and then we're off. With any luck, we might make it in time. But only if I drive. What? Mike, just do it, goddammit. Get that tuxedo, get dressed, and get out of this damn room. We have to go now. Uh, okay. What the? This wasn't here before. This wasn't fucking here before. I'll wait outside while you get changed, but hurry up. Everyone's waiting for us. Uh, sh sure, let's go along with this. I don't know what's going on. Picks up the tuxedo, examine it, and shrug. I need to talk to Chris. I have no clue. Whoa. What happened? Did I black out? You look at your clothes. Wait, 
didn't I? This is getting way too creepy. I'm certain I changed these clothes. Chris, I need to talk to Chris. He's waiting for me outside, right? There's nothing here. Dark alleyway. These are the kinds of places where people get killed. Wouldn't want to be down there. Okay. Let's try this again. Uh, where is everyone? Am I dead? Chris, where are you? What the... How? The phone has no charge! What's going on? Look at your phone. It doesn't show who's calling. Only a blank screen. Maybe it's Chris. Um. Okay. Why not? H hello? Your phone suddenly shuts down. What? This is exactly what I'm thinking. Throw the phone away. Alright. Um, let's just look around here for a bit. Let's see. Use condom in the trash bin. Oh, lovely. Plant made of plastic. Okay, that room's locked. Oh, hey, a finished flag. What's that small text under it? Finland gained her independence a hundred years ago. That's 1917, folks. Sixth of December, to be exact. Time for a celebration. Signed, Jorma. Huh, a hundred years is long ago. It's a long time. Good for them. Okay... What time is it? Huh. Clock seems to have run out of battery. It stopped. Locked door. Sound of a baby? Hello? Is someone there? It went all silent. Okay. Huh? Was someone there? Chris? Was that Chris? Maybe I should go check it out. How about no? Let's not. This one stopped too. Lights are off in this machine. Can't see what's inside. Locked. Locked. I can hear some faint music from behind the door. It sounds odd. No. Let's listen to the music. I'm sure I've heard that somewhere before. Ah oh well, I have to get going. Darn it, no, I wanted to sit there and listen to the nice calming music. I can't leave yet, I still have to find Chris. Water doesn't look healthy at all. I think there's something swimming in there. Oh, lovely. Oh, uh, let's see. A new book from N.A. Weiler called What's a Paladin? I should check that out someday. Hey, someone is selling a copy of Shaq Fu. I thought they were all destroyed. Trash can, just trash. Locked door. Oh, hey. Porn magazine hidden behind this plant. I'm just gonna leave it here. Okay, I don't know the number for that door yet. And that's a long number. Uh, okay, so I don't... Let's go back here and see. Visit Ari Island. Fun for everyone. Something is scribbled below. Don't visit. It's a depressing place. <laughs> Lovely. Okay, so... I guess... We go down this way. 
a hallway. Was there a hallway here before? No. The clock it isn't moving either. Are all these broken? Really creepy this is. I haven't seen a single working clock in this entire hospital. How long is this damn hallway? It, just, it makes no sense at all. <gasps> oh gosh. What the? Okay, this was a bad idea. Run, Mike. Just run. Oh gosh. Oh gosh. What the hell is that? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, um, wait a minute, this place seems familiar. Chairs, lots of chairs. Let's see, look at that, what the, I know this place. Another flashback! Mike, stop pacing around. He's late. I hate waiting. It's been almost an hour. I'm sure he'll be here any minute. Sit down, relax, read a magazine or something. Flailing around like a madman doesn't help anything. Why are we here? You know why. I'm telling you, there's nothing wrong. This is useless. Mike, you agreed. Now, at least now, we'll have an answer. I know I agreed, but I'm telling you, there's nothing wrong with me. I can feel it. We just have to try harder. Oh... We've been trying for so long and and nothing. I mean, I want, no, I need answers. Something, Mike, I need something. Fine, but when he comes and tells the results, you'll see there's nothing but grade A Navy SEALs coming out of me. You look at your wife and give her a wink. She smiles at you. You know, while we wait, we could go and... Mr. Smalling? I am. Hello, I'm Dr. Jones. I'm terribly sorry I kept you waiting. It's fine. Please, follow me. Mike, may I come with? Um, Sure, why not? Of course, I want you to hear this. Please, have a seat. I'd rather stand. Okay, as you know, having a child is a difficult process for healthy couples. It may take years and years. Just cut to the chase, doctor. The results are in, no? Yes. Well then, let's hear it. Mr. Smalling, there's really no easy way to tell this. You're a very healthy man, but... But... You glance at your wife. She's pale as a sheet. I'm very sorry, Mr. Smalling. The tests show that your sperm is very weak, and it's practically impossible for you to father a child. I'm sorry. No, that's impossible, Doc. There's no way my soldiers ain't up for the fight. Oh, gosh. There's no need for profanity, Mr. Smalling. Fuck that, Doc. Do the test again. Something must have gone wrong. There's no goddamn way that is correct. These tests have a 99% reliability, Mr. Smalling. They're correct, but it's not the end of the world. 
there are multiple ways for couples like you to have your own child. No, I refuse to believe this. Your tests are a damn hoax. Come on, honey, we're leaving. We're going to another doctor, someone who can actually do his job. Your wife stands up. You notice her eyes getting teary and she starts to sob. Mike, I... She wipes her eyes. I need a moment, please. Alone. Please, Mike. I'm very sorry, Mr. Smalling. God. What the? What? No, what? This can't be. This ain't the right room. Okay, um, let's look back out the window again. I can only, I can see only darkness. It's like staring into the void. Alright, uh, let's check the closet again. Can't check the closet. Nothing else I can check. Okay, back out. Again. Back here. Locked. The hell? Wasn't there a... I must have hit my head harder than I thought. It's quiet now. Logged. Bathroom. Locked. Check the trash. Bloody bandage. Not going to dig through them. No, I wouldn't either. Alright. Locked. Let's check this door. Nope, can't check that door. Well, let us check that door. Right, um, the morgue? I guess I don't have a choice. Oh boy, that was locked. Well, fuck. <laughs> I can't see anything in here. Hey, you. You might need this. Who's there? Hello? Something hits your foot. What the? Pick up the object. A flashlight? Chris, is that you? What's that? Blood? Chris, I swear to God. I'll kill you tomorrow. This ain't funny, Chris. Stop messing around. Okay, what about this door? This door is locked. Can I go? What the heck? It's completely blocked. Wait, there's something written on in here in red paint. Don't dead open inside. Okay, yeah. <laughs> that makes absolutely no sense. <laughs> Don't open dead inside. Yeah. <laughs> Chris, this is going too far. Let's get the hell out of here already. Oh gosh, I I don't like this. Can I not? Please? I I don't I don't want to. Nope, not going that way. Looks like a potato sack. Large containers that have something inside them. The lid seems loose. Sure, let's take a look. It's ash. Why should, would anyone store ash? You put the lid back on. Um, let's take a look in the blue one. Ash. Okay, so they're both ash. There's only darkness. Even my flashlight can't light it up. That's seriously weird. Okay. Um... Thank you all for watching. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to ring the bell icon to keep up to date on all the videos. And remember to free the feral wildflower in you. Bye-bye.